In this video, we will discuss the working process of Kernel Exchange Backup and Restore tool that is helpful in the backup and restoration of Exchange mailboxes. This software is embedded with advanced algorithms that make it easy for the users to backup and restore their Exchange mailboxes. Also, the advanced filtering options of the software enable you to backup and restore mailboxes based on item type, date, folder selection, etc. So that you don't have to back up the whole data, but just the specific mailbox data. The tool is helpful for both single and multiple mailbox backup and restore. Here we will focus on backup and restoration of multiple mailboxes. Download Kernel Exchange Backup and Restore and install on your system. When you launch the tool, you will see two options, Backup and Restore. Click the Backup option for Exchange Mailboxes Backup. The Restore option allows you to restore Exchange Mailboxes that we will discuss later. To add Exchange Account for Backup, click the Add button on the screen. You can also import Exchange Mailboxes from a CSV file by selecting the Import from CSV option. However, if you choose to add Exchange Mailboxes manually, then enter the credentials for Exchange account. You can create a backup for hosted Exchange server as well as on-premises Exchange server. For example, if you want to add hosted Exchange server, you will have to use the proxy server name, Mailbox Login ID, and Password. If you want to back up multiple mailboxes, select the option List all mailboxes using above credentials and then click Get user mailboxes. Also, make sure you are using global admin credentials as you cannot back up multiple exchange mailboxes without global admin credentials. However, Kernel Exchange Backup and Restore also gives you the option to import exchange mailboxes from CSV file. So, if you have a CSV file that includes all the Exchange mailboxes, then click the option Import from CSV and follow along. Once all the mailboxes are shown in the tool, you can select the specific mailboxes or select all mailboxes by clicking Select All option and then click the Add button. The selected mailboxes will be shown in the next wizard. Click Set Filters and Migrate button to move ahead. Before starting the backup process, the tool allows you to select specific data type for backup, like primary mailbox, archive mailbox, or public folder. You can select them from the drop-down menu, and then hit the Migrate button. In the next step, you are allowed to apply specific filters to the mailboxes, such as you can select a specific time for backup, include or exclude deleted or empty folders, or item type. You can also skip previously migrated items by selecting the option. After applying the filters, click I am OK, Start Migration. You will be asked to select a location to save the backup file. Select a location, and click OK. The backup process will start. Once it is complete, a notification will appear on the screen confirming the same. Click OK. After the backup process is complete, you can save the backup report in a CSV format by clicking Save Report to CSV. Similarly, you can backup Single Exchange Mailbox with the help of Kernel Exchange Backup and Restore tool. The restore process of the tool is a bit different than the backup process, as it involves restoring mailboxes from PST file. To restore Exchange Mailboxes, go to the Welcome screen of the software and select the Restore option. You will see two sections on the screen. Add Source and Add Destination. Click the Add button in the Source section to add PST files for restoration. Once PST files are added, you can add Exchange Account in the Add Destination section by clicking the Add button. Just like the backup process, enter the credentials for Exchange Account and select List all mailboxes using above credentials option to restore data to multiple mailboxes. Then click Get user mailboxes. You can also import Exchange mailboxes from a CSV file if you have one. All the mailboxes will be shown in the tool. You can select the specific mailboxes or select all mailboxes by clicking Select all option and then click the Add button. Once both source and destination are added, you will have to map the PST file with the Exchange Mailboxes from the drop-down menu. After mapping the source files with destination mailboxes, click Set Filter and Migrate. 
in the next wizard, select the type of mailbox to which you want to restore the PST files data, and then click Migrate. The filter section window will appear on the screen. Apply specific filters to the PST files data, based on your requirements, such as you can select a specific time for backup, include or exclude deleted or empty folders, or item type. You can also skip previously migrated items by selecting the option. After applying the filters, click I am OK, start migration. The software will start restoring PST files data to exchange mailboxes. Once it is complete, you will receive a notification on the screen displaying, process completed. Click OK to end the process. You can save the restoration process in the CSV format by clicking Save Report to CSV. Hope you guys like the video, you can download the software from given link. Thanks and have a nice day.